remember, a few years ago at Motoring TV, we built a Lexus IS300 to come up here to Minden, Ontario to run in the ice races. Well, guess what? It's a couple years later now, and you can see behind me, things have changed a bit. Welcome to the Lexus Sport Cup. The concept for the Lexus Sport Cup is simple. The cars are all 2001 through 2005 Lexus IS300. They're rear wheel drive. Modifications are open, but there is a claimer rule of $3,500. That stops teams from putting lots of money into the car. The series runs for six consecutive weekends, part of the CASC Ice Race Series up here in Minden, Ontario. This is our first year, and we have 15 cars already in this series. These cars are a lot of fun to drive on the ice. They're rear-wheel drive, they have a limited slip differential, and they're automatic, but we just leave them in third gear. Now, the cool thing about having identical cars, it's all about the drivers. It's very different from normal racing, for sure. Um, the handling is a lot different since we're racing on ice, um, but the studded tires really make a difference, so you can actually get grip, which is useful, but it's a lot of fun to just drift into the corners and see what the car can do. So you can do uh, you can do little things. You can do quite a lot of things. Um, the main thing is taking the sunroof, uh, the lights, those sort of things out. Anything that can crack, other than windshields, gets taken out just so glass doesn't end up on the ice. Uh, we we put some rivets in the body panels to sort of hold them together a bit better. And sometimes we strip out the interior to make it lighter, but that's really up to the driver's preference. Other than that, just a set of uh, set of tires, and you're good to go. We all know the Canadian winters are absolutely brutal at times, and you definitely need snow tires. Well, these Hankook iPike RS tires are regular snow tires, but they have street studs in them. Depending on where you live in Canada, you might be able to use these. The advantage is they're a lot better grip on both ice and snow, and they're easy to do. You just put them in with a stud gun. So remember, check where you live in your area. If you can use studs, keep your safer on the road. You may remember on MotoringTV.com, we ran a contest right before the holidays. We called it the Ride with Russ contest. Well, we got a winner. His name is Bill Oakman, and he's coming up today to ride with me. Why he wants to go 120 kilometer hour on the ice with me and 50 and my closest friend, anybody's guess. But let's see how it works out. We got a chance. Well, hopefully the car is warm. I entered the contest because I thought it would be uh, an opportunity to, to experience ice racing, something I've never uh, seen before, so, and to watch it from the car, it's going to be great. There must be something in it that uh, that makes everybody come out and freeze their butts off to uh, to have some fun and uh, do some racing. I'm very excited to uh, for this opportunity. Unfortunately, there was a bit of a tangle up with a couple cars. Somebody ended up in a snowbank and bounced out onto the track. Uh, and then from there, it was just sort of everybody kind of came in like bowling pins and bounced off each other. So unfortunately, the car I was racing is done, but we got another one getting it ready now. So we'll be back next week. We knew when we got that first motoring TV Lexus IS300, it'd make a great ice racer, and it really has. Now with 15 more, the Lexus Sport Cup is born. Now I can tell you this much, it really does make the winter months go by so much faster and, yeah, it's a ton of fun. We still have some room if you want to come and join us. There's a nice white one right there.